Hello everyone, I'm Tom Trin, Senior Application Engineer for Valent Corporation. Today I just want to show you and illustrate how the old Ron VOC worked with a bare HMI model X2 Base 7, which is a 7 screen. So what I have right here is I'm simulating the page on the IX developer because I can actually simulate the screen without having connected to the screen. Uh, to the PLC and the PLC I'm using today to communicate to the HMI is Omron and X102. So what you see here is I have the, so here's the screen right here and I, I have a button and when I click that button, the lamp will turn on or turn off depend upon the status of the button when I click and then a, uh, another data numeric entry here for floating point register and also another numeric data entry here for integer as I changing the value here the bar graph will change accordingly as well as the dial indicator so right now it shows 100 and that's why the bar graph is at 100 so as the dial indicator if it changes to and you notice also by the way below here is actually the watch windows within the Omron Sysmax Studio. So it, as I change the value here, you will see it's updated here as well. So I'm going to change it to, let's say, 50. Voila. So the bar graph is now at 50. So that's a dial indicator. Let's say I want to go and change the value here to, let's say, 15.9. As soon as I hit enter, you will see it's update here. There you go, it's 15.9. I'm going to change to another value. 65.7. And voila, 65.7 is now in the PLC. Okay. I can click this button right now. The lamp is false. As soon as I click this button, it will change the state. So now it's red. And voila, it's actually true. I can click it again. So now it's false. So that's how the Bayer HMI X2 Base 7 works with Omron PLC. Now, Bayer HMI does work with many, many different controllers out in the market. Mitsubishi, Alan Bradley, Siemens, you name it. They, they have all the drivers and also for all the motion controllers as well. So if you have any questions, please call us at the number below. And thanks for watching.